Hey guys, Technivers here. Earlier today in a different video I was talking about Matter Control 2.0 and I was actually in here just a minute ago and I noticed there was an update. This is version 2.20.1.10422 which is interesting but nonetheless uh, I can't find it anywhere on their website. So if I go over here to their download page um, you'll see that, let's hang on I was just there I'll back up you'll see it shows download 2.0 um, so I don't know I hit the download button hoping it would take me to a different page and maybe that page would be updated I don't know if they literally just rolled this update out and haven't updated their page yet or not um, but I can show you the page here if we transition you see that it says download 2.0 and that is basically it so um, if you download that version and then go into matter control and we'll jump over there and hit uh, this check for update button right here it should pop up with update 2.2 so um, the other interesting thing is I don't know what they've changed because if I go in there it doesn't have a what's new feature uh, it does tell me that the version is different I did literally watch this download so I know that they've made some updates uh, it looks like all of the primitives are the same still so nothing new there uh, I haven't checked the design apps yet uh, I don't have an account signed up so we're not gonna play with that right now uh, but yeah I mean it looks basically the same maybe it's a slicer update maybe it's performance updates I'm not quite sure uh, the interface looks like it's pretty much the same as well so nothing really new there Um, uh, there are a bunch of settings for materials in here. I think this store tab, I don't think that was open by default before. Um, a lot of how-to guides. This is kind of neat. How to succeed with 3D printed metal on a desktop 3D printer. Um, top 10 prints to calibrate your 3D printer. And some inspirational, here, try doing this. That's kind of cool too. So, um... You know, this is a lot of stuff that comes from the Matter Hackers website, and Matter Hackers is a big player in the industry as far as uh, documentation, as well as making some very, very good filament. So um, you see their ad up here for their ABS, their PLA, their PETG. This PL PETG looks kind of funky here. You can see the support structure. They're not putting much support in there at all. That's uh, interesting. Um, basically that's the gist of it though uh, this is matter control if you have not already seen this slicer I wanted to show you a couple of things it's capable of it does have this nice Tinkercad like interface where you can come in drag these primitives in change their parameters to whatever you want them to be and make models that way which is pretty nifty for building stuff up um, you can do some pretty cool tricks with this it also has this handy text feature where you can come in and add text to pretty much any surface I don't know where it went um, <laughs> and there are a ton of fonts in here too now I've gone over all of this stuff already in other videos so my main purpose for making this video is because I'm curious if anybody else saw any documentation. Am I going crazy? Was there really an update? I mean, even up here it says version 2.0. So um, I'm not sure what the difference is. And if you know, I'd like you to point it out to me. And here you have it. I must be losing my mind. I found the Matter Control release notes. It says Matter Control 2.19.10 came out September 27, 2019. So... Uh, either I literally had the program open while they were rolling out an update and they haven't even updated this to show what changes are in the new version yet or I have literally begun to lose my mind and you know that's always a possibility but what I'd like you to do is if you haven't already tried matter control it is definitely worth giving it a shot so jump over to the download page now download it and see if it updates see what version it tells you it is um, also, help me keep an eye on this page because I'd like to know as soon as they post something if the date they list right here is today's date because 
yeah, like I said, just kind of an odd experience. I, I've been really busy lately, kind of stressed out, a lot of things going on, and you never know. Maybe Technivorous is losing his mind. As always, this channel is brought to you by the Spine Patreon supporters. If you'd like to support the channel on Patreon, head over to www.patreon.com slash technivorous. That's going to be it for this video. As always, I am Technivorous, and thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out our main channel page where we do a free giveaway for our subscribers every month. So far, we've given away things like a Capricorn PTFE tubing kit and spools of filament. So the giveaway videos are always pinned to our main channel page. So all you have to do is subscribe and leave a comment on the giveaway video for the current contest. Feel free to check out this video right here. YouTube picked it for my content just for you. And if you haven't already, you can hit the subscribe button right here. So what are you waiting for? Become a Technivore now. Thanks again. Technivorous out.